Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some Eastwood. Uh, this is a game I have never played before, I just have heard that I'll probably like it. Uh, there's an opening cutscene here which you can't just play from the menu, so I need to start it like this, it's a bit annoying. Uh, this should work, hopefully it'll let you see the whole thing. Uh, what happens, I'm gonna close my bedroom door to try to what the noise getting in. This is a really nice animated cutscene. I had to see it once to get used to settings so I could set the game up for recording, so I know what it looks like and it, it is very pretty. Again, I know basically nothing about this game. I know I'm supposed to play it with controller, so I have one connected, but we'll see how we go. I think that person with the white hair is your protagonist. Uh, they were in like some of the marketing picks. M maybe that Solux there is the is the villain. I mean, maybe I don't know. They might be a hero. I don't know anything about this game. <laughs> oh, my mic needs adjusting. Hang on. That's better. Anyway, yeah, you got the idea. Extremely gorgeous opening animation here. <laughs> uh, then we get a title screen. Uh, I don't know if having my face down here will be a problem. I will try to move it around as necessary. Uh, title screen's really pretty. I pressed any button. <laughs> I pressed A to be precise. Uh, this is interesting. Uh, you can see the mouse cursor on screen, even though I'm using a controller. I can move the mouse around and click stuff. Uh, and I can't use the left analog stick to move around. I can use the D-pad, though. So that's interesting. Uh, also, I believe I have to press the B button. Like, it doesn't take into account that you expect Confirm to be on the right side of this sort of controller. Gotta press B. Yeah. Uh, I assume these are, like, save files. I haven't gone this far yet, I only went to the settings, so... One. This game uses an autosave feature. It had some other things, but yeah, autosave. Don't, don't quit the game while it's saving. Basic stuff. Once upon a time, in the farthest reaches of the continent, there sat a prosperous kingdom with a soaring tower that reached the clouds above. I'm thinking I might want to tweak the visual settings. Uh, this is like a pixel art sort of game, and it's got like options to show it with a CRT filter on it and stuff like that, which might look better. Uh, I'll let this start first and see how it goes. For many years, the kingdom lived in peace until, following the tragic death of their king, the demon king disguised himself as the chancellor and claimed the kingdom for himself. I've heard of those. Those are those evil chancellors. Yeah, I've heard a few about a few of those. <laughs> Feeling off the castle from the rest of the kingdom, he locked the princess away within the tower. This is extremely cliché. I assume it'll take a bit of a shift. Day after day, the princess wept, gazing out the window at her poor kingdom below. Around that time, a young knight from a faraway land was squeezing the salt water from his cloak. Looking up from where he'd washed ashore on the beach, he saw the castle in the distance. That castle would be his destination, and the start of his adventure. Rota? Oh, come on! Lost again? I even had the full attack skill this time! I'm not sure why it's showing subtitles when there's no voice acting. Stupid demon king, how are you supposed to beat him? I guess there's really no way unless you get more party members. Oh crap, look at the time. <laughs> time for school. 
I'm getting an Earthbound vibe. Sam, let's play again after school, okay? I think Sam is our protagonist because of the uh, white hair. That that character appears in the promotional artwork and stuff. Or at least someone who looks like that. Sure thing. See you later. Interesting that they call one of their group four eyes when two of them wear glasses. <laughs> I gotta go wake John up. Uh, who's me playing as this guy? Maybe? I don't seem to be able to do anything, which is weird. I can pause. Uh, maybe I need to fiddle with my controls. Can't move with the D-pad, can't move with the analog. Do I need to reconfigure something? Hmm. Let me see, are there options? Put the TV and go settings. Nope. Settings. Yeah, the thing is, there's nothing about the left analog stick here, so I don't know if it's working or not. <laughs> I'm getting the vibe it's not working. But yeah, you can see that you can't configure it in here. Uh, I'll try moving with the keyboard and see what happens, I suppose. Yep, keyboard is working, so my left analog stick just isn't being picked up at all. That's weird. Uh, for now, I might just play with a combo and see how we go. <laughs> I guess I'm playing as this guy. I think this is John. Prologue. The world above. I seem to have a hundred salt shakers. John, come on. The bell already rang. If we don't get back to the dig site, the mayor's going to dock your pay. Okay. So, I'm playing as this fellow. <laughs> uh, hang on, I'm going to pause the recording. Okay, I switched on my remapping software. It now thinks this is the PS4 controller. And I can move around with the left stick like I'm supposed to be able to. Uh, hopefully that won't cause any further problems. We'll see how we go. Uh, Alright, let's get going. Go map with the share button. Okay, immediately I need to make a change. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, map. Salt, right? Bye. Okay. I don't know if I'll need to actually click the touchpad, which is a thing you normally do on a PS4 controller. It doesn't have one of those, but I've got it set so I can I can access stuff. The experience of playing this game with a pro controller, out of the box, not great. <laughs> it's really pretty though. Look at this pixel art. Hello. Men are the absolute worst. But aren't you seeing someone right now? I can't say that's very convincing coming from you. Hi, Muller? Muller is different. Can you expect us to believe that? <laughs> it's called love. You wouldn't understand it if I told you, dear. I guess the subtitles are there because the text in the game is kind of pixely, you know, maybe a little hard to read. I assume that's the idea. Oh, where are the display settings? I want to fiddle around with that. Large mode, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can change it from. It starts on clear, you can make it CRT. Oh, render quality, make that normal. Let's try CRT and see how we do. Oops. Sorry to fiddle around with all the options after I'm in the game. <laughs> render quality, CRT. Why? Right. In game. Oh, yeah, that's very, that's very CRT -y look. It probably won't have a great bitrate, uh, so it might be good to change the settings again. <laughs> uh, 
uh, sorry about this. I, I would have fiddled around before starting the game, but I needed to show you the cutscene and stuff, you know? Uh, yeah, make it, back, make it clear again. There we go. Resume game. Shouldn't you be at work or something by now? Knew it. You're one of those types, aren't you? Yeah, changing the render quality made this a lot easier to read, so... Those types? Yeah, a loser. Can never hold a job, am I right? I'm gonna put up the volume a little bit for you. Hang on. Sorry for so much fiddling around. <laughs> uh, okay, that should be good. Yeah, that looks a lot better on my little graph here. This game's quieter than the last one I played. Every day, it's the same damn thing. Ain't nothing to do down here but sleep. Maybe I'll get lucky and dream me up a sun today. Gone, looking suave today, as always. Are you in a hurry again today? Expect no less from Pot Croc Isle's number one digger. Guess that's where we are? Pot Croc Isle. Exclamation point over here. Shipping. You can refrigerate your memories here, but when you take them out again, will the new you really be you? Save your memories? Okay, so the fridge is a save point. <laughs> okay. Up at the crack of dawn, bleed for every coin you earn. Must be tough being a digger. I assume we want to go up the staircase to continue our quest? Doesn't seem to be a run button. I go pretty slowly. A bit annoying, but I don't know, maybe maybe that won't be an issue. That's how the game goes. Can I interact with here? Turn on. Oh, the little sinks. Look at that. We can waste water. Hello. Maruku Miyazaki. If it isn't Little Sam, made any new friends today? You all want to go to the world above? I'm getting Undertale vibes. <laughs> I don't know if that's intentional. Full front. You shouldn't be here. Okay. A crocodile. A bit of Undertale, a bit of Earthbound. Is this the way I gotta do digging? Oh, hello. Oh, hey, John. What are you doing here? You better be scooting along if you don't want to be late. I'm guessing we're getting something similar to Earthbound with, like, combat? Maybe? Maybe it's turn-based? I don't know, though. Bigger dorms? We're past the dorms. This is where the actual digging happens. Yes. No one has gendered Sam yet. I'm curious whether they're non-binary. That would be sweet. Oh, come on, don't be stingy. I'm only borrowing it. Two days, tops. I'll give you back it back as soon as I finish it. I that every time. Yet somehow I've never gotten anything back. That's... well... These are some very nice sprites, by the way. Well, 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 John's here. Mr. Punctuality as always. Your watch must have been carved by the God of Time himself. Is that a robot? And you're looking as adorable as always, Sam. Do you still remember what I taught you? Of course. Over pit, under rock, bury treasure around the clock. In the mine, rocks go blast. Safety first, or you won't last. <laughs> Gotta dig, gotta dig, dig to make those riches flow. Oh, cute. Bravo. You'll make an excellent digger one day, Sam. She, oh, she, there you go. You sure will. Even better than John, I'll say. Okay, so Sam uses she, her, I guess? Still might be no binary. <laughs> We've got a problem, a big problem. Slugs! Oh no! 
John, thank God you're here. Come with me. Gotta fight some slugs? Now wait a goddamn minute. You shouldn't be running off all pell-mell like a little Sammy. It's dangerous in there. You should stay right here with your Uncle Chage. Chage? We'll protect you from them slugs. But, but I'm fine. A very good point. Sam, would you like to hear about when the mayor went up against the evil dragon? Not that one again. Oh, I'm leaving, I'm leaving Sam behind. John, John, have you seen the slugs yet? Huh, John, are they super scary? Alright, I guess I'm just playing as this guy now. <laughs> this does remind me of Mother 3, where you're playing as Duster at the start, and then later you're playing as Lucas, so I might end up... Sam might be the protagonist. Bugs are in the cave to the west. There you are, John. The slugs are in the cave to the west. And you, go find the key to the storeroom. We'll need the bombs in there to take care of the slug nests. Alright. <laughs> I guess I'll find out what my salt shaker does soon, too. <laughs> oh, I have a frying pan. Oh, hello. I guess I can pull this rock out of the way. A rock? What's this thing called? A crate. <laughs> And then I can just whack the slugs? Yeah, alright. So we're talking real-time combat, and... A little bit janky. Not bad, though. Oh yeah, and you can see down the bottom I've got three hearts. So it's a bit of a Zelda kind of thing. Plugging that in do anything useful? Oh! Uh, don't do that. Um, hmm, hang on. Oh, how, I see. I can switch it off over here. And then I can get rid of those slugs. Okay. Uh, I can plug it in going that way. A bit of a puzzle. There you go. Okay, and we can go this way now. John! Nests, John! If you don't bomb their nests, they'll just keep coming back. Alright. Oh, I can't go this way because of the... yeah. Okay, so I'm not allowed to go that way until I bomb their nests. Okay. 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 Uh... Did we end up finding the key to the storeroom? I'll go down this way. Oh, hello. Okay, and hearts drop. It's, it's very... it's a very Zelda feel to it. Looks like I have a bit more salt than I did. Is that like money? John, you'll find bombs in the gunpowder closet. You can use them to bomb those suckers' nests. Key required. Uh, I guess I have to backtrack and look for the key. They said the other guy had it. You. What are you waiting for? Chuckles is already over the storeroom. I'll be, uh, right behind you. Okay, I'll talk to old Chuckles. <laughs> oh, is this not the gunpowder closet? Is that something else? Maybe that thing in the middle is the gunpowder closet? Maybe this is the gunpowder closet down here. I don't know. Oh, that looks like it might be a gunpowder closet. Hello. Open. Oh, that's a key. Is that the key to the storeroom that I needed to find? Did I just find it? Yep. A comb. Do a cute little pose when you get a bomb. Find in my weapons menu. Can I take some more? Doesn't look like it. Uh, where's my weapons menu? Here we are. Bomb! Do I have it equipped? Triangle place a bomb. Okay.
Take that, you suckers. I like that the slugs behind walls can be seen with their, like, shadows. Or silhouettes or whatever. It's, it's nice. Nice little touch. Interesting that you can just unplug it like that while it's on. You don't get zapped or anything. It makes sense, but also it's a bit strange. <laughs> like, for gameplay reasons, it makes sense. And, like, in real life, you can unplug cables and stuff without switching them off, but they don't normally spark like that in real life. <laughs> oh, cool. I can get bombs out of these things. That's handy. Uh, are you an extra strong one? Oh, you electrify yourself, and I only have a frying pan which is made of metal. I see the problem. <laughs> uh, what have we here? Some pots. Smash them, get some, get some... Is that, is it salt? Is the money salt? That would be really cute. And, like, it would make sense, because salt is, like, an extremely valuable commodity. The uh, nest was on top of where the light lighting uh, power was coming in, so the lights weren't working. Interesting. My little uh, character sprite in the corner there looks a lot, a lot cooler than my in-game sprite. I gotta say, <laughs> it's a, it's a bit silly. That is definitely a Zelda Finding Things theme that they're going for there. A gear part. I don't know what that does. Maybe I can upgrade my gear or something? around holding a frying pan. Normal everyday things. <coughs> Is it really a problem if these slugs are here? Like, don't, don't, don't eat me! <laughs> oh, hello. Well, Aren't you a cypher sore eyes? I thought you were one of those carnivorous critters. Oh, well, the slug's carnivorous. Oh, I see the problem. Me, Quack Dr. Baguda. No, no, no. I I've got to stop calling myself that. I'll stop getting any patience. By the way, did you know that those slugs secrete a most peculiar gel? They do. And it can even be used as an adhesive of sorts to heal wounds. That's why I'm here, to get my hands on some of that gel. Oh, how was I to know how crazed those mucilaginous mites would be? Use some fun words. I had no choice but to hide myself away in here. Don't go. Please don't go. You're that... that... Yes, you're that remarkable digger, aren't you? John, was it? I heard that you were the first one to dig yourself up a person. Yes, yes. Here, take this, would you? Hot dog. I may not have been able to find any gel, but that doesn't mean I'm useless. Give that thing a try. I assume eating a hot dog heals you? I'm also guessing that because I wired up, I got electricity coming from there, this first room will open up some more stuff. It did! Look! Hello! John! Slugs! A whole mess of them! I'm not really doing the right voice for these characters, but I'm having fun. Oh, down here? What the? You big lout? What'd you just do? Huh? 
expecting you to say there were slugs inside? Oh wow, yeah, that's a lot of slugs. Max heart's increased. I guess I got a heart container. <laughs> I think John's gonna be alright. Eh, yeah, he is a hardcore. He's really gotten himself a neck pie and a caca pie this time. Yeah, thanks to you. I I'm fine, I had a frying pan. <laughs> oh, John! <laughs> We were just, uh, talking about how to rescue you. <laughs> John! The mayor! The mayor's on his way, John! Can I play Sam yet? Sam looks cute. Well, crap. If it's over and I've got a whole lot of nothing, Man's not gonna be happy. I... I... I'm getting out of here. Uh, hey, wait! Come on, John. Man catches you and there'll be hell to pay. Why? I got rid of the slugs. Like, feels like that was probably the main thing you would have done, right? <laughs> uh, alright. I haven't dug up a single scrap. The mayor's gonna kill me. Don't concern me. Traitor. What did you say? Hush. Hush, all of y'all. He's here. Alright, you good for nothings. Well, let me see if you've lived up to your name today. Empty. And another one. Empty. You really are good for nothing. All of ya. And you. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Why is this kid still here? I think this is a playground? He belongs in school. Tuition fee will come out of your paycheck, of course. Did you hear that, John? I get to go to school. Um... I, I mean, yes, but... He gone. Woof! Thought that old fogey was gonna dock my pay again. He had us half to death. At least our salaries made it out unscathed. Found sand root number times two. Check your backpack. I don't know what that is, but I found it. Damn, sand roots again. I don't get paid in cash for once. I've eaten nothing but sand roots all month. Oh, they're food. Alright, okay. Well, at least things worked out. Gotta hand it to you, John. You really do get us out of some vines. Guess you're off to school tomorrow, ain't that right, little Sammy? 
It does seem pretty empty around here without you. I'll be back, I promise. Don't you go playing hooky now. You gotta listen to that teacher of yours. Eh, uh, yeah, I know, I know. Don't you I know, we mean it. Don't want you getting shipped off to Paron? What, like from Hades? Okay. <laughs> Paron on, is it like, 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 like she's gonna die? Ain't that right, John? Ah, uh, John, that pan of yours. Huh? Oh no! John, your pan, it's broken! Have Mason take a gander at it. Yeah, ain't nothing that old codger can't fix. You can find the gent at the Sunnyside Ranch. See if he can't tune that puppy up for ya. Because then my fine frying pan is broken. Got a hot dog. Got a bomb. Yeah, frying pan I can't use it because it's broken. Where did the best items? I got some sand roofs, right? Where are they? Get in my backpack. Oh, ingredients. They're an ingredient. Sand roots. Pot Croc Islands are famous fruits. So I has an apple that evolved in Pot Croc's unique soil. Okay. We got paid two apples. <laughs> oh, and we can cook things. Okay. Okay, we've got a, we've got a, a food system. Or a recipe system, one might say. I guess because the frying pan is broken, I can't really go very far until I fix it. It's probably deliberate. Off we go. I don't really know where the guy I'm looking for is. Over there, I guess? A little flag? Fast travel. Oh. Um, can't do any of those things yet. Okay, player. Oh, that just like it's me. All right. Where it's phrased, I thought it was like, does this game have multiplayer? You find other players, but no. That's not what it was talking about. On the next episode, the knight faces his greatest challenge yet. Will Snow Peak Castle survive this deadly threat? Tune in next time. Yeah, it was getting good. He's probably going to find a new ally next time. But I don't know. At this rate. I'd say we still have two weeks left before they show the new character. Hey guys! Oh, hey Sam. You off work? Is Earthborn already over? Yeah, it's finished. If you want to watch it, you'll have to wait for the rerun. Oh no! Today, one of the four generals attacked the Snow Peak Castle. So now the knight's heading there to stop him. It's weird though, I don't remember this part from the game. Oh right, about that. I heard it's something that happens in post-game. You have to defeat the Demon King first, after that you can start a new game plus. New game plus? I don't even have any party members yet. It's gonna take us 5 billion years to get new game plus. We should play Earthborn too, Sam. The more of us playing, the better the chance we can beat the Demon King. But I don't have a memory card. Old Star, you should buy one for Sam. After all, without a memory card, she basically can't make any friends. Wow. <laughs> You'll buy one for me? Really? Oh gosh, oh wow, I'm finally gonna be able to play Earthborn! Time to put your money where your mouth is, old stash. Boy, grocery has memory cards for sale. So buy a memory card. And you can have friends. Why, it's been a long time since I've seen your face around here, John. You don't normally do your shopping at my store. Anyway, what can I get you today? I like expansion out of stock. Hot dog out of stock, coffee out of stock. The only thing that's in stock is the memory card, which costs 25 salt apparently. Retained memory card. Hey 
Thanks, John. Now I finally have my own memory card. Something for Sam, then, was it? Come to think of it, you spent a lot of hours on that thing when you were young, didn't you, John? That, uh... Oh, what was it called again? Right, right. Earthborn. That was it. Sounds a lot like Earthbound, I must say. <laughs> now we're cooking. We got ourselves a mage. Should we go to the castle and fight the Demon King, then? You're not even gonna grind a bit first? You still have time before the Demon King's ritual is complete. Well, to the Royal Castle. Are you even listening to me? Guys, I got one. I got a memory card. Perfect timing. We're on our way to the Royal Castle. Not that we're actually going to be able to win or anything. <laughs> okay, okay, gosh. I mean, I guess we do have a mage now. So there is a chance we might be able to beat him. Why don't you try, Sam? Maybe you'll have some beginner's luck. Really? But I... I don't even know how to play. Don't worry, it's not like Kuroda can beat him either. I mean, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Let's get this show on the road. It's already pretty late. Mom's gonna be calling me for dinner soon. Okay, okay, I'll give it a try. Wanna play some Earthbound? Starting, it's starting. First, you need to plan out your strategy. Teach him a lesson, Sam. Our oh, is cute. I, I like the I like the little pigtails. First, use the knight's strong attack skill. Strong attack, demon king. Let me give you a tip. Even if you put the monkey in your back row, he can still help you fight. Choose switch the weapon with your mage. Just like that. Now you can use your mage's skills. Fireball then. Merchant? What can a merchant do? What does then when you take a loan and collect interest from them every turn? I love that. <laughs> How much AP does the mage have? Uh, none. It's gold. I guess they spend gold? Damage job by nine is increased. Demon King is in debt. <laughs> King is broke. Here it comes, the Demon King's ultimate skill, Energy Sap. Now, what are you gonna do? You don't have any AP left. All according to plan. x ball, go! Oh, yeah! Next, use an AP potion. Everyone's AP in five. Just like that, now I'll be able to use some awesome skills. Skill, full attack. Demon King, mage, skill, heat laser, Demon King. Merchant. Uh, well, they're broke already, so I guess I just want to attack them. Here it comes, the Demon King's second ultimate skill, Hypno Wave. All strong monsters use this move. This isn't the time for you to show off. You can give a way out of this. But that's the point. There isn't a way. Your entire party is being controlled now. You can't do anything. That sounds great.
Are the mages still there? I'm sorry. I lost. Don't worry about it. The fact that you were able to hold on for so long is pretty good for a newbie. I already said you need to gain more levels first, but no, no one listens to me. Please don't kill me. <laughs> oh crap, look at the time. Gotta get home for dinner. See you tomorrow. You get back here right now. I'm gonna head home too then. See you guys tomorrow. Hey! Whatever, I guess we'll just have to play tomorrow. Oh right, guess what? I get to go to school tomorrow too. You serious? Why didn't you say so earlier? That's awesome. Now we can hang out tomorrow at school too. Here, take this. I can give it as a reward for the day. Pain slime? Check it out in your backpack. This is a pick spool. You can use these to get more items in Earthborn. You get them from that capital machine over there. Just put in a token, pull the crank, and bam! Pix ball. Anyway, I should head off now too, but I'll see you tomorrow. Make sure you're not late. I will. I'll leave super early. See you tomorrow. Uh, I'm not sure where Sam lives, now that I think about it. Jump place. There's, still, there's still someone over there, so I guess I want to head that way so I can repair my frying pan. That was a cute little interlude that was clearly inspired by Earthbound. <laughs> As a state? Uh. Stop right there. Mayor's taking his rest. Go this way. Uh, can't do anything up there. I don't know how to get to that flag. Maybe if I go past the school? Doesn't look like it. School has closed for the day. Quite ghoulish inside once all the lights have been turned off. You best run along now. Okay, yeah, I read that already. Looks like I can't actually get to that spot. At least not right now. Unless I'm misunderstanding something, which is possible. Where am I now? Long time since I've seen your face around here, John. Not often you do your shopping here. Anyway, what can I get you today? What have you got? Treasure Radar? Bomb Upgrade, Bomb Box Expansion. Treasure Radar sounds cool. I'll take that. Did you do something to equip it or...? No, I can see there's a little signal icon on the screen now, so it must be automatic. It looks like you go from... you go right from the school, but it doesn't seem like I can actually do that. Unless... Oh, wait, yeah, you can use this. <laughs> okay. Da, 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 da. Looks real spooky. There we are at Sunnyside Ranch now. Hello! There ain't nothing in this world that I can't fix. Name's Mason. Mason the Fixer. Whoa wee wowza, this pan! It's the same one a right brave bunch of girls once used as their weapon. Make a mean stir fry too. You've got my attention now, kiddo. Let me up the ante on that pan for you, huh? Guess they're fixing it? <laughs> Brilliant! A true masterpiece! I'd even wager this is my best work yet. Well, one of them. There. Give that old sand group a whack. Don't let me down now, boy. Huh? This again? And sometimes since I've seen someone try this. Who was it got in last? Captain Tiger, was it? Let's see if this fella's got what it takes. Ain't gonna be so easy, that's for sure. 
The rules are simple. Get the droop into the loop. I call it Droop Loops. Ingenious, isn't it? I'm thinking of copywriting it. Here he goes again. What the hell is a Droop Loop, huh? Who cares? I want to see what this guy's made of. Go, John, go! Old to unleash a powerful attack? <coughs> Wowza! First try? Okay, so I, I have- I can charge my attacks now. John must be the most talented droop whacker I've ever seen. Yeah, well, it's all thanks to the number I do in that pan. Wonderful. Brilliant. Seems like you've already got the knack to whack. <laughs> knack to whack. That's a good one. Yeah, I give five. Mason's expressivity continues to astound. What you're holding can be used for. What you're holding can be used for more than just taking ra racial slurs heads off. It can make a mighty fine dinner to boot. Dinner! Let's go home and make dinner, John! I'm starving. Here, take this. Oh, another sand droop. It's the droop you just gave, gave the boot. A bit droopy now, though. <laughs> droopy droop. That's a good one. <laughs> New fast travel point. Quest log updated. Okay, the little friendly flag is now over there. Oh, I see. I think I can actually do fast travel now. Back to John's house? Time to make dinner. Dinner, dinner, dinner! So wait, does Sam live here? There's only one bed. What's for dinner tonight, huh, John? Is it Sandro? Tell him we're gonna eat Sandro, huh, John? Uh, yes. Book. Uh, let's put a Sandro. Can I put in the hot dog too? Oh, it doesn't let me do that. I can see it there. I just need to be able to select the backpack. Let's just cook three of them together. Uh, not sure what the slot machine is for. If it's how you get like a critical success when you're cooking. Animation's pretty cute. Sandroot pasta. The hardest nail of sandroot becomes soft as soup after cooking. Pour all over some noodles. Yum. Gap in training achievement, apparently. I get to go to school tomorrow. I said that at school there's a big courtyard. Wait, there's only one chair at the table. How do two people live here if there's one bed, one chair? <laughs> I, I don't I don't understand. Does Sam actually live somewhere else? But but there's nothing blue there, John. There's nothing green there either. Oh, there's some chairs at the front there. Maybe he moves one. No, they're bolted down. I mean, I said all that stuff is fake. But John, I know it's real. I saw it, John. Yeah, that we, we ate pasta. What now? To be continued. I'm covering the word continued with my face a little bit, but that's what it says. Yep, save progress, that sounds good. Continue. I'll go a little bit longer than an hour because I had some setup difficulties. Just want to get a good vibe on what the game's about. John! Wait, so is Sam using the bed and John just sort of stands up and sleeps? Wake up, John! Yes, that, that is what's happening. <laughs> Alright. I have to go to school today. Oh 
Sorry, John. Today I get to go to school with Kuroda and the others. I'll wait for you at the door. Crocodile hourly alert. Oh, let's go to school. No talking. Okay. Annoying brat. You there. Stop right there. I am new here. Today is my first day. Your first day? At my school? And who, may I ask, said you could attend my school? Uh, yesterday? Silent. Those without a reference that aren't allowed in my school. No one gets in my school without a reference letter from the mayor. Okay, I guess we could say the mayor. Uh, this way. Thankfully, we did find where the mayor's estate is earlier, so we can just go talk to him. Stop right there. We came to get a reference letter from the mayor. A reference letter, huh? Hmm, I suppose it's fine. Holy cow, this house is huge! The mayor must be super rich. Who's there? Oh, it's John. How did you two get in? Cool. When did I ever say anything about going to school? Yesterday, at the dig site. A derelict child like you has no place in school. You must be mistaken. You wanted to see us, Mr. Mayor? Oh, little Sammy, what are you still doing here? Didn't you be at school? Don't tell me. You're playing hooky, aren't you? Didn't you promise you were going to listen to your teacher? Ain't no good to be breaking promises now. Your words have never been spoken, my man. Those who break their word are sent hot skipping straight to old Karen. Ain't that right, Mr. Mayor? Ah, uh, um, yes, yes, of course. You should always uh, keep your word. Run along to school now, you adorable little jack and ape. But I, I need a reference letter. Right, right, here you are. Don't lose it, or else you won't be able to get in. Ain't man's reference letter. Imbeciles, blockheads, good for nothings. No one, and I repeat, no one is allowed to enter without my permission. Out of my sight. Damn. Damn, not in there. He said damn. <laughs> uh. Alright, well, let's head to school. Time to learn some things. Huh, what a loser. Just like your old man. Loser. Loser. Oh, oh that poor kitty. Did I say you could look at me? If you don't want to be a loser, you'll go to the surface. Look like your crazy dad. Oh, I don't like you. Look like your crazy dad. The surface? You mean like the forbidden land at the dig site? Exactly. And then he'll never come back. <laughs> Stop that. Here comes another one, Grandis. That kid John picked up from off the street. No one wants her. What a weirdo. 
Even look at that hair. Why is it all white? She's the main character. <laughs> Just like an old hag. Old hag. Old hag. Shouldn't bully people. Well, that's some some hair you've got going on there. <laughs> yeah, and what are you gonna do about it, huh? Grandis's uncle is the mayor. The mayor. Don't tell me you want to go to the surface in his place, do ya? Maybe I do. Ooh. Nothing scary up there. In fact, it's beautiful there. Clear blue skies, green grass. Who are you? You'll find out. One day. Oh now, your destiny awaits. Who do you think you are, huh? Talking to me like that. You're nothing but a street rat. Street rat. Okay, Aladdin. Hey, listen up. Granis is talking to you. What did you say? Whatever, let's get out of here. You're not scared of them? I thought I told you. Without a reference letter, you can't... One reference letter, as requested. <laughs> Not sure how you got this. I suppose it will do. You better be smart, young lady, and don't cause me any trouble. Yeah, I'm gonna keep going to school, John. There she goes. Guessing I can't go in? Hey! There's no open house today. Parents aren't allowed in the school. There's three. But they're terrifying. Uh, what am I doing now? It's still a long time before school gets out. Go kill some time around town. Yeah, I can do that. Actually, there's a quest marker. Over there? Go over there. Crazy about work, huh? How about it then? Try your hand at some good old fashioned ranch work? Sure. Oh. Well, look what we have here a new face. Welcome to the Sunnyside Ranch. Pretty hot here, don't you think? That's because this here farm's right next to the ancient ruins. People say they're full of blister and hot steam. Yunch! Not that you care, huh? Ah, you're here for the real star of the show. The heart and soul of our ranch. Hot crabs! <laughs> I, I know it's because they're crabs that live in pot, but I mean... Crabs that smoke pot. <laughs> what? Something wrong with their shells? Huh, those ain't shells, those are pots. Get it? Pot crab? That's the key. You plant seeds for sand roots inside the pots. Then, you put the pots on top of the crabs. This makes the little suckers run around like crazy. The faster they run, the bigger the little seeds grow. And once our ten-legged friends can't run no more... <gasps> well, that's when you know the sand roots ready. Die. You may not look it, but this fruit's something else when it comes to sheer poundage. Especially that one there. Only our strongest-legged crabs can grow on red-leaved ones. After all's said and done, we plunk the fruity tooties down in that there hole. And that's a wrap. Time to call it a day, boys. What happened to the pot crabs? Um, well, probably best you don't know. I think they die. Uh, so what I'm actually doing... Am I kidding them, or...? <clears throat> what do you want me to do?
Oh, am I hitting these ones? Yes, okay. I can do that. I don't know if I'm aiming for a certain score or anything, but I'm getting crabs in the in the in the end route to the holes, which I guess is what I'm supposed to do, so. Is that a good score? Not bad, not bad. For someone new to this, you do some mighty fine work. Here's your pay for today. It is salt. I thought so. <laughs> Are you talking about big eyes? He sounded as that infamous fantasist, you know? I heard it from my mum. He claimed he'd been to the surface. He wanted everyone to move there with him. So the mayor sent him to Karen. Anyway, probably best not to associate with him. Give it back! Really went in there. Where is it? Where's my coin? Ugh. Rubble now. So mean. Stay out of it. I'll just bully you too. Yeah, it's a pain you didn't see anything. My slog updated. Request to go and help. Sam's gotten in some trouble at school. I don't know how I know that, but yeah, I, I do wish to help her out. Fuck proc school. You again, huh? Whatever, he's the one who wanted to go in there. Let's go! John, what are you doing here? It doesn't matter, we've got to help Daniel. Here he is? You're actually going in there? They say a fire-breathing iron dragon lives beneath here. Better be careful. <laughs> Isn't that just the bathroom? I'm very confused. Yes, it's the bathroom. Oh, there's an underground tunnel. Oh, I get it now. Okay. I thought that the whole threat was they put the, the, the coin in the women's bathroom so Daniel couldn't get it. But Sam could. <laughs> but that doesn't seem to be what the idea was. Ow. Slugs. Go away, slugs. Uh, do I have to push something onto that? Yes. Like, there's another person here. Couldn't the other person help me? It doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Ha! 
heart orb. Oh, piece of heart. It's a piece of heart. <coughs> stop regrowing enemies. It's very annoying. I'm better off using the, the big smash as much as possible against like every enemy. Oh, I get it. Just push this down here, it'll block the steam, I can just walk through. Yeah. Simple pimple. him. Oh, hey little kid with purple hair. Love you. Daniel, you, how did you, everything's gonna be okay. We're here to rescue you. Oh, there wasn't a boss fight. Unless there's about to be one now. What are you doing down there? You don't think something happened, do you? Maybe they run into the Iron Dragon. Hey, God have mercy on their souls. Don't say things like that. Sam will make it up for sure. Besides, she's got old Stash with her. We made it. Come on. Oh, we did make it? You saved me. Thank you. I was expecting, like, a boss fight, but maybe there's about to be one. Ta-da! Man, you're okay. What happened down there? They guys just took off like a light. Is there a reason to go back down there or to be done? Oh, we need dinner now. Uh, fast travel. We exit the building first and then we can fast travel. Okay. Ooh. Did Sam go to class? <laughs> Last bottle. Okay, that's it for today. Kitten is ready. Where is that boy? Bell, wrap it up, folks. Work's done for the day. Finally done. Man, I'm jealous of John. Yeah, but what's beneath the school? Been more dangerous than the dig site? Is it? You doing okay now? I, I, I b believe my d dad. I've seen it too, you know. World above ground. Really? What William? What world above ground? I, I didn't hear anything. I'm gonna check the shops and see if there's more cool stuff I can pick up. Big stock. Used to immediately restock your ammo and bombs. Oh, I see. Does that go in your inventory or is it? I'm not sure how it works exactly. I need to get like microchips to get the upgrades by the looks of it. Interesting. Oh, parts, right. Yeah, I found one part. Yeah, I, I, I get it now. Okay. Uh, you're closed already.
Daniel told me about his dad, William, you know? He used to claim that he'd seen the world on the surface. You know William, John? No one believed him, you know? No one called him a... a, a fantasist. He just... Poof, did. One says the people who lie are sent to Karen. You ever heard of Karen, John? Can John speak? Is he mute? Hey, John. You don't think I'm a fantasist, do you? I only have seen the world on the surface. It's blue and green and... It's huge. Huge, John. This real said it's open house at school tomorrow. You have to come too, John. I was like, you, you have to come too, John. <laughs> I should thank Sam, you know. Yeah, if it weren't for her, you'd have ended up just like your dad. Hey, don't say things like that. Stand there, come on. And about, about yesterday, when you and the dad saved me, he isn't my dad, he's just John. Oh, uh, right. Sorry. Hey, God, this is hopeless. What B Guys is trying to say is that he's grateful for your help yesterday. Yeah, I, uh, thanks. It's all because of that lie my dad told. That wasn't lying. It was all above us. That's enough. <laughs> Gotta promise me you won't say anything about that at school. The principal here, she'll blow her top. Get going then. She wouldn't like it if we're late either. John, I'm going to school. John, time for school. All right, I gotta come with open day or whatever. <laughs> Not really sure what the game wants me to do. Oh, hello. Class is about to start. Are you ready to join us? Okay. We're hiding underground. Above us lies nothing but death. Here you enter the forbidden land. The limp in a path to the world above. Green disaster to Pockrock Isle. Ms. Real! Ms. Real! What is it, Grandis? If it's so scary up there, why do people still want to go? That's... well... Because the sky is blue up there. The most beautiful thing you've ever seen. Damn. Don't... You're lying. Have you got any proof? I've seen it with my own eyes. Oh yeah, that's right. You're a fantasist too. <laughs> No, I'm not. True, I really have seen it. What did I say, huh? Another lie. Fantasist. 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 I'm not a fantasist. I'm not. Uh-oh. <laughs> Jumping on the table. Principal Tacoma. Bam! Get out! You're to leave this classroom at once! 
not a fantasist. I'm not. True. You weren't lying. But I... Show them. Prove it to them. But how can I... Forbidden land. Cottonhead's in trouble. He was asking for it. Nobody messes with me and gets away with it. It feels like I should be playing as Sam. It feels like this is her story. But I'm still playing as this guy. <laughs> it's a bit strange. I assume she's headed for the Forbidden Land. Yeah, which is that way. I haven't been in here yet. Is there anything of interest in here, or is it just another shortcut? Eh, nothing too exciting. Ran into the forbidden land. We should tell John. Why bother? That chicky's not coming back. So long as we keep our mouths shut, no one will even know. Oi, John. John, I mean, John, my man. Sam ran into the forbidden land. Sure did. She's gonna get killed in there. I was just trying to convince everyone to go rescue her. Who was it? Who went to the Forbidden Land? Not good, the mayor already knows. I find them and they'll be hell to pay. I assume that's the mayor talking, but I already put on a robot voice. <laughs> you better go get her, John. Don't worry, I won't tell the mayor. I guess you want to go this way? Hmm. Did the elevator come back down after Sam used it, or...? I have some questions. <laughs> Ancient ruins. <coughs> There's a hole there. Across the gap. Oh, oh, oh. I see. It's a it's a puzzle. We do this. There you go. Easy. <laughs> and then the door opens. Excellent. I solved the puzzle. Because <laughs> yeah, I have my um power attack now, which can knock things forward and across gaps and stuff. Uh hello. <clears throat> you seem vaguely threatening. Well, no, up do anything? Mm, doesn't look like it. <clears throat> so, 
how did Sam get through here without a frying pan or bombs? Like, presumably she did, right? plants. Got another gap. Got a prompt. Oh. Let's get the boss room. Taking a few hits here. I just noticed that there's like a little Amy cursor thing when you're doing this. Okay, cool. That 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 is good. I thought it was just like the direction you were facing, but that's better. That's something. Earthborn manga. Sure what that's relevant for, but I've, I've got it. That's cool. <laughs> There's another direction I can go that. Oh, I can go down further. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, it's these guys. Hello. Oh, my tra treasure track is activating. Treasure around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. And this door, I guess. Fifty salt. How salty? And a couple of lockers. I'm guessing the lockers are empty. down any further le levels because it's submerged. Might be able to do something. <laughs> oh, I found some onions. Wait. <clears throat> Love a good onion. Mushroom from, from that friend. <coughs> and a 
hand root from that one. I don't like that these guys grow back so quickly, it's very annoying. Oh, cool. We can use those to play the gacha machine. <laughs> uh, then we want to go back to that locked door, which is around this way. I'll have a whole bunch of cool ingredients by the time I get out of here and I can make some interesting combinations. Uh, I'll try this door first. Okay. was hidden, so I feel like it's probably... Oh, hello! Hard orb! Hey! Two of them. Get into that room? Like that door's blocked off. There might be another way. In this wall. Doesn't look like it. Okay, down we go. How about the next level being flooded? So I'm not quite sure what to expect. Uh wind? <laughs> not gonna lie, not that's not what I expected. Uh can I just walk through? Yes I can. Oh, I can throw a bomb into it and that breaks it. Okay. I can drop another bomb. And therefore get through. Sorry. Let's see what we're doing here. I might want to do a bit of that just to get rid of them. Get that? I can reach it. This way. Mini boss? I mean, kind of. I'm not sure if mini boss is quite the right word, but it's an enemy to fight. It's like just mashing the button is the easiest way with these guys. They're kind of quick, so you don't really have time to charge up as they approach. Pretty sweet music. Oops, let me drop the bomb. Uh, can I retrieve it? Ah! I think I can? Yeah, you can pick the bomb back up. He said to press the right button, which I didn't do. <laughs> yeah. I guess if I bomb those, they might open the wall or something? Otherwise, I don't really know. Oh, okay. Yeah, that works too. Not going over a pillar. Cross. I'll eat that hot dog if my health gets really low. <laughs> oh, another one of those pillars. Okay, so on here. Pop it over there. I don't know if that's close enough. It is close enough. Excellent. And then we can flip this thing around. Boop. Can 
go this way. Yeah, there's uh, a bunch of these guys. The spam, the attack, there we go. Got the gear. Oh, another gear part, neat. Two of them. We've got one of those pillars on there. Right, double over. There'll be like a door behind it, I'm guessing. Oh no. Kind of. The slope I can now climb? Yeah. Wait. Oh, I'm here. Alright, so now I can push this out of the way. I can go this way. It's all coming together. Oh, and then I have to switch on the generator. Let's go. We got a bit of a wiring puzzle here. Uh, I think we want to go in here first. Maybe then we've got to plug that in. I'm guessing we want to move this. I don't know why. Do I just do anything? I think do. Okay, and that's how you get back to this door, but we we're on the other side of that door already, so that doesn't really help us. Get over there. Go this way. Ooh. Yeah, powered up whatever that thing is. Oh, it left, right? <laughs> uh, a couple more of these uh, Frippids. I'm assuming they're called something like Frippids. Like, the game hasn't told me the names of any of the enemies. Get the slugs. They're called slugs. We got here. I can walk on that? Is it like oil or something? I thought it was like a hole that. Bombs here, plugs in the way. Get more salt. Looking for salt. I don't really know where I'm intended to go. Like, I'm trying to look for Sam, but she can't have gotten through all those puzzles because they weren't done. So, I don't know where she is. in this way because there's a whole bunch of enemies guarding it. Could also be the main path. Uh, it looks like it might be the main path and the other one was the treasure path. I don't know. Yeah, this is treasure. We got another gear path. Neat. Generator over here. Put it on. Plug that into there and get into this room. Bombs. Already have bombs though. Looks like a bit of a puzzle though. In this room. A bunch of old bottles, I guess. Mm. 
bomb this. Oh, nope. That wasn't it. That one. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. <laughs> I just kind of got it. <laughs> I'm back down, apparently. Oh, got some eggs. I do like all the different styles of, like, chests you get stuff out of. That one was like an S key or something. It'd be a good thing to put an egg in. <laughs> and keep it cool for a decent amount of time, you know. Flip this. Oh, just flip that one. I think that'll work. I'll drop a bomb here. And flip it over. Yeah. Awesome. Um, what about this one? That's not me crossing, right? Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. It has more of an effect on the bombs than it does on me. machine? Oh sweet, uh, I think I need any of those things right now. Castle. Here's a fridge. Save your memories, save. Thank you fridge. That means it's about to be a boss battle. Done. Done! Look what I found! How did you get here? Like, I did all these puzzles to get here. How did you get here? <laughs> Green on the bottom. And blue on the top! Oh yeah, that thing I just switched on earlier. Uh, hello. I think I'm gonna feed you bombs when you suck like that. Don't suck. <coughs> yeah, you're 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 a Zelda boss. I do Zelda boss things with you. <laughs> I think determines which attack they're gonna use. I think I need the blue eyes to get them to suck up their bones. A boss fight, really. Fun. Max hearts increased. Got five of them now. Uh, 
What's happening? John! John, where'd you go? John! John, what's wrong, John? Are you okay? John! Is someone there? Help! Who are you? You sad. Please, please help John. Pray only you can do that. The only way to see the light is to cut through the darkness. Wait! Cut through the dark. Hold to charge Sam's energy. Great, you learned energy bubble. Okay, I'm playing as Sam finally. <laughs> as the obvious protagonist of the story. Very dark here. I don't have to see what I'm doing. Like it's up to me to get her done again. You're gonna blow things up again, aren't you? You sure that's a good idea in here? Not to worry, I'll make sure to use just the right amount of blast powder. Find a safe place to hide. This is not the robot voice, but I'm not, I'm not doing the voice. <laughs> Fine, I guess I can give you another chance. Like there was a slight miscalculation in the timer. Like always, you mean? Wow, Izzy! This is incredible, the discovery of the century. Where are we? A uh, city? I like Izzy. Izzy looks cool. Oh, hello! That's my character. That's Sam. Playing a Sam again? Yes. There was a treasure in that dark room a moment ago, but I might want to come back and have a look later. Oh, hello. Ah! Save me a bottle, okay? L little Sammy! Huh? Where did... Where'd you just pop out of, huh? This can't be good. John, John is... 
still down there. To be continued. That's probably a good spot to wrap up. Um, uh, you get the idea. Um, it's, it's very, it's very, uh, Zelda-like. It's, it's very Earthbound. It's very, it's very Undertale. Bit of a mix of all those games. Cute as hell. Sam, it's adorable. <laughs> um, but yeah, that is, uh, that is Eastwood? I think? Is that the title? I've already forgotten. is Eastwood. Yeah, uh, so that's all for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope me fussing about to get it working wasn't too annoying. Uh, but yeah, that's all I gotta show. Bye! <laughs>